behaved if she'd been told to get out of the flat. Uh, and the jury said the fire brigade should also have told the five people in the other flat to get out once it was clear how much smoke was inside it. And in fact, the advice that they were given was uh, the standard advice in such fires, what they call fire survival advice, which was to stay where they were. Uh, on the basis that fires often stay contained within individual flats, uh, at least for a period. But in this case, uh, very unusually, the fire spread uh, rapidly downwards uh, as well as upwards. And the inquest had a lot of evidence about why this might have happened and why the consequences were so catastrophic. The jury were told that the design of the building with all the exits leading to a central stairwell could have been a factor. Uh, fire experts told them that renovations carried out in the 80s could actually have made the building less fire resistant rather than more so. Uh, there was evidence that Southwark Council had failed to carry out a mandatory fire assessment. Uh, the jury said that numerous opportunities were missed to carry out these safety checks. And the inquest was also told that neither residents nor firefighters seemed to know that balconies on either side of the block led to fire exits, which could have uh, offered a way out for residents and a way in for firefighters. And just a quick word, Jonathan, why has it taken so long and what happens now? It has taken a long, a long time, more than three years, uh, in fact coming up to four since, since the fire. And the inquest, as I said, began in January this year uh, and the relatives had, uh, have de of those who died have, have criticised that delay. One uh, reason was that the police and the Crown Prosecution Service have been considering whether the council or anyone else should be prosecuted for manslaughter, but uh, in the end it was decided to take no action because there was thought to be no realistic prospect of a, of a conviction. So the, the coroner, the judge who's been sitting in this case, will now uh, write down uh, recommendations based on the jury's verdict and they will go to the Department of Communities of Local Government, to Southwark Council and to the London Fire Brigade. Thank you very much indeed, Jonathan Baker reporting. It is 13 minutes to five. Across 